Hello there, Danger Noodle here, and this video I wanted to answer a question. How tall can you actually build a game? Now you may be wondering, this could be a stupid question because, well, there's building constraints. Every build area has a set box that you can't really go beyond. Well, I'm here to say that's wrong, and we can actually go way farther than anyone actually previously tried. For this, we will need a lot of linear slides, but not just that, we'll need to extend it eventually across the entirety of this box, and somehow tilt it so it can point up and go into space. Spawning this in, it instantly wants to start, oh god, it, it just wants to extend itself out as much as possible. It does lock itself back here, and now it's starting to go up the mountain. Yeah, so it got caught on the mountain, so we need to figure out a way to rotate it up so that it doesn't get stuck on anything, but at the same time, make sure that it doesn't actually collapse. Alright, what I've done is I've taken that linear slides, added it to a servo that can rotate it up and down, and then added a whole bunch of wheels so we can just drive this out of the hangar. Now everything is hooked up but I haven't tried anything so this may or may not work. Oh what? Oh god. What's going on? Uh, that, that. What is happening? <laughs> oh god. Have I invoked Clang? <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> okay, so I've basically created a spring, and it's constantly pushing everything up. I think I know how to fix this. That wasn't the issue. <laughs> I mean, let's see if we can still... Okay, no, it's destroyed. Oh god. Oh god, it's still doing it. It's still- Ah, whoa, uh. Alright, let's just try and get out of here. Oh my god, it's driving. It's driving. How is this both working and not working? Oh, okay, that's actually helping us. We're so close. We're so close to getting out. No, don't break it. Alright, it's coming up. It's coming up. And now we just extend. Oh my god. Oh god. What is- Oh no. Ah, no, tilt forward, tilt forward, tilt forward. No, no, that's not supposed to happen. Oh god, oh god. Wait, we're still going. It's still extending. This can actually move us. Well, this worked a lot better than I expected, in all honesty. I'm surprised we even got out as far as we did. I mean, the rotor still works. It's just now stuck in this position. So I think we need to move some of the wheelbase back somehow. I've added a double section of wheels attached to a rail system that should hopefully push this out of the garage, while at the same time moving the center of mass slightly more immediate as the wheelbase goes back to try and support it. And let's spawn this. Okay, so it's it's still doing the thing. Oh god. Uh, oh, wait. <laughs> it's now stuck in there. <laughs> it's now stuck inside the pill. What? <laughs> How did it get in there? No. Okay. Okay. Ah. Uh... Alright, I added some wheels to the slide itself. Hopefully that'll dampen it smashing into the ground and spazzing about. That being said, it might not even do anything. Yeah, it's an issue with the front. Okay, can I? Yes, there we go. Okay, let's start driving forward. No, this isn't working. Oh god. Oh god. Alright, this is broken. Uh, I'm gonna do this without any vehicle damage. Because that seems to be the only thing that I am having issues with. Beyond that, it's just a matter of then getting this out. Ah! Come back! Come back! There we go. Okay, try forward. Let's do this. Let's get out of here. Why aren't we going forward? No! Alright, let's 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 just extend this out. See if this can do anything. Wow, we're creating a wave. And this is slightly more stable. So, I'm almost thinking immediately when it spawns, it tries spewing it forwards. And then it should be a lot easier to drive forwards, because that seems to be the issue, is it's springing about and it's causing everything to spaz out, because now everything's pretty stable now that it's halfway up the mountain. Let's change some of the gear ratios of these pushing forwards, so now it's just a matter of getting into the seat and driving forward as fast as possible. Uh, is it even possible to get out of the hangar at this point? Alright, well, it's definitely possible to make a vessel larger than the original starting size. However, the methods that I'm doing aren't working, and I know the reasoning. It is theoretically possible to do this, and if you somehow manage to actually create a working system that utilizes all of the space inside, please leave a comment down below. I'd love to take a look at it. Beyond that, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, remember to leave a like and subscribe, and thank you for watching.